Okay, before we do the part 2 of the insecure direct object reference, remember to log in in your second tab. Then let me go to the fifth tab. We need the second button, but we need to intercept it using the Z. So let me press this button first. And this is what I need. So, okay, so I'm going to change this request first to put instead of get and this is the user I will change the content type to JSON and the content length. Okay, this is what I'll be using for the content. So let me just copy this over. I send I will get a well done message so this is how you solve this last part All right. and the rest of the reading I'll leave it up to you on the last tab